In this lecture, I'll be going over the importance of checking every screen during a uh, install of a program that pops up to make sure that uh, you're just installing the program you intended to. It seems to be an ongoing trend that when you go to install one program, uh, they have made deals with other companies to install other programs along with it. And sometimes it's not obvious that you'll be installing the other program. So here we're going to download a program called Auslogix Disk Defrag. It's from a company called Auslogix. And here we're going to uh, CNET's website to do the download. And first off, you can see here from this download page that there are many different banners here that also look like download buttons and you want to make sure you don't click on those kind of things. You want to make sure you scan the entire page, look it over, make sure you're clicking on the correct download link for the program you wanted. So then you click download now and it starts a download and it's asking where you want to download it to. So I have a downloads folder set up. So I'm going to choose to save it there. And then once it's down, done downloading, I'm going to open up the folder and then minimize the install window and come back to the folder which is downloads and double click on the installer and then click run and go through the usual steps say yes so here you want to start from the very beginning read what it says there and click next and accept the user agreement and click next and choose a install destination click next and create desktop icon that's fine but you see here you've already installed the program but here they're giving you the chance to install another program that you probably had no intention of putting on your computer and so you're going to make sure that you read this and it says check here if you want it and by default it's checked and with this program, I've seen this program installed on hundreds of people's computers, but never once have anyone actually installed it themselves. So click uncheck that box and then click finish. And that way, by uh, unchecking that box, you'll just install the program you intended to and not the other one that they tried to get you to install. Again, CNET's a legitimate site and Auslogix Disk Defrag's a legitimate program, but this seems to be an ongoing trend. Here I'll demonstrate it again with Adobe Reader which is on pretty much everybody's computer. It's free, totally legitimate program. But even here, when you're just trying to install Adobe Reader, if you don't read the whole thing and you might miss where it says optional offer, that's gonna install the Mac V Security Scan Plus in the background. So again, you wanna make sure you uncheck that and then proceed with the install. And again, you don't wanna just click on any screen that comes up without reading it first because you want to make sure that you're getting what you asked for and requested and not getting a bunch of uh, other stuff installed in the background. So here it's going to save it, so that's fine. Install the, save the install for, uh, program and then click on it and click run and click yes. And then again, make sure you read everything that pops up as it goes along. And from this point on, it should just install the Adobe Reader and Again, that's that's perfectly fine. Now, so far, these two programs that I've demonstrated this with are legitimate from legitimate companies, but sometimes you'll go to download, say, and install a little screensaver or a little game or something like that, and it will try to install possibly even multiple. I've seen one program install six or seven in the background that people never never intended to install. So you got to be very careful. And again, this seems to be uh, increasing this trend. So I would just warn you to be careful and read carefully each step during an install.